What is going on people? Welcome back to another video on AJ5 and in today's video guys, yes it is another one on AD8 which has more or less been fluctuating over the last 24 hours. As you can see it's sitting at 53 cents at the moment. So what is next for this crypto? A lot of people have been asking me and DMing me, should I buy into it right now? I don't know what to do, should I wait for it to drop? As you can see the lowest it's been in the last week was about 40 cents. So obviously it does make a huge difference buying it at 40 cents compared to 53 cents depending on how much you uh, invest into it. But yeah, we're going to be looking at does it have the potential to drop further and if so, how low can it go or is it going to pump back up in value over the coming days and if so, how high will it go? I'm going to try and cover both buyers and sellers point of view and short term and long term traders as well. But before I go into any of that stuff guys, if you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well as like the video as I'm trying to hit 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys can help me hit that target I will be doing a cryptocurrency giveaway which you guys can join by simply subscribing to the channel and for a bonus entry following me on Instagram link to that will be in the description box down below. So we are on the Coinbase website at the moment looking at the daily chart as you can see it's been more or less fluctuating at the last 24 hours even though it's been very volatile up and down all over the place overall it has been fluctuating over the last week 28% down guys that's obviously with the crypto crash that's taken place it's taken quite a big hit over a quarter of his value has been wiped off in just a single week and over the month it is an overall 44% down which is not looking too great so Scrolling down onto the coin market cap website, we can also see here that the trading volume has gone down by a massive 25% in the last 24 hours, making it just $1 billion. The last video I made on ADA, the trading volume was sitting about $3 or $4 billion, and right now it's dropped all the way to $1 billion, nearly going below the $1 billion mark. So, yeah. Not many people are trading the crypto right now. They don't have they can't really because they're just holding on to it. They can't really sell it because they're probably on a loss at the moment. So all I can do myself as well is just hold on to it and wait for it to go up or buy more to bring your average value down. But that's what we're gonna go into looking at is it worth buying or selling or holding on to it. So on the screen right now, we do have the candlestick pattern chart with the Fibonacci scale, which I'll be using later on in the video to do some technical analysis. For now, I'm going to bring up the MACD indicator to do some price prediction, as I'm pretty sure that's what most of you guys are here for. So we have also got the SMA indicator, which is the purple line running across the chart, which is currently valuing ADA at 69 cents. However, it is trading at a much lower value at 53 cents, meaning it is not performing as well as it's meant to. And of course, it is underperforming. So Let's zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short term traders. Before I go any further guys, just a little disclaimer. This is no financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Anything I say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make, I will not be responsible for. So zooming into the 30 minute chart, we are looking a little bit bullish here. We've got the blue line and the orange line going in a positive direction. However, the whole point is that they are not looking too steep. So it's going to be a very, very minimal increase in value. Of course, we are going to see dips. We are going to see red candles as well. And we are going to see green candles. It's going to be a mixture of ups and downs. But the overall outcome over the next couple of hours, so towards the end of the day today, should be just about be more on the positive side. But again, as I mentioned earlier, it's not looking too steep. So it's not, it's, it's not like it's going to be a major increase or a major price bump or anything like that there's going to be a very minimal increase in value moving on to the hourly chart next couple of days again very similar to the previous chart guys we are still looking positive still looking bullish so over the next few days so towards the end of next week we should expect a higher value than what it's worth at the moment but as i keep mentioning in my videos it all depends on where bitcoin moves if it goes upwards then yes we may see it going you know gaining a decent amount of value however if bitcoin does drop below the 29 28000 dollar mark then we may see another drop not just on bitcoin or ada but the whole crypto market we may see it drop a little bit depending on how low bitcoin goes again if you are part of my telegram group chat i put daily updates and predictions on bitcoin in that group chat to show you guys where to expect the market to head towards and so far it's been quite accurate again if you guys want to join the link to that will be in the description box down below it is usually 29.99 but using discount dec10 you get 50 percent off to make it 14.99 a month however this is limit this offer here is limited to the first 100 members that join and over half the spaces have already gone so there is literally a limited amount of space left after that 
it will increase to 29.99 so make sure you're quick if you guys want to join just to make it clear once you well, once you sign up you get put into two group chats one is where i'm showing you guys what cryptos i'm buying what cryptos i'm selling the other one is just a general chat where you guys can ask questions discuss cryptos and that is also where i put my daily price predictions and updates on specific cryptocurrencies and bitcoin is also one of them so yeah you do get up updated on a regular basis throughout the day on what to expect on the crypto market but any questions or any queries you guys may have just send me a dm on instagram if not the link for for you guys to sign up is in the description box down below so let's move on to the daily chart next couple of weeks what can we expect now we have taken quite of a u-turn we're not looking too positive we've got the orange line still looking bearish going towards the negative direction however the blue line has started to move towards the positive direction however what i would say is do not trust this one here because obviously with the crypto market crash that's taking place that's what the uh, uh, graph the orange line thinks you know what is going to keep dropping keep going down in value however I am expecting Bitcoin to recover hopefully in the next two weeks or end of May. I am expecting it to recover and go above the $33,000, $34,000 mark. And obviously, if that does happen, then so will the whole crypto market. We'll see a recovery on the crypto market as well. But I will make sure to keep you guys updated as much as I can and as soon as I can on my Instagram page and on my YouTube channel as well. If there are any major updates or major news that come across that can have a potential impact on the value of the crypto market. So make sure you stay subscribed and turn on the bell notifications to get notified every time I upload. And also follow me on Instagram. Link to that will be in the description box down below. So now what we're going to do is we've got the Fibonacci scale on the screen right now. We are trading in the red zone, meaning it is, I call it the danger zone, the lowest point we've been to in a while. As you can see, the last time we were in the red zone was all the way back in February last year, over a year ago, about 14, 15 months ago is when we were in the red zone and right now as well. So yes it is a good time to buy it however i am expecting it to more or less fluctuate at the current price range what i do use is dollar cost averaging also known as dca so how that works is for example i always tell my telegram members to do that as well whenever i buy cryptos uh, whenever for example if you've got 500 dollars that you want to invest in ada invest 100 dollars every day in case it does drop that down in value then your average value does go down so yeah that is the safest way for me to invest anyway but yeah these are my predictions on my takes on ADA. I am expecting ADA to hit the green zone potentially in the next four to five weeks. We should be up into the green zone, hopefully recovered by then. But again, if you guys want regular updates on Cardano, let me know in the comment section down below. And I'll try and keep you guys updated on a more regular basis on this crypto. But yeah, that is pretty much it guys for today's video. I'm not going to keep you guys here for any longer. A massive thank you and a massive shout out to every single one of you who have been subscribing, liking, commenting and just supporting the channel in any way or form. And especially those of you who have been subscribing, I appreciate each and every single one of you. Let's try and hit 100k subscribers by the end of the year. And the 50k subscriber giveaway is now out. So check out the link in the description box down below. If you guys want to be one of the nine lucky winners that are going to be winning cryptocurrencies. And also check out my Instagram because you have all you have to do is tag two friends on my Instagram post of the 50k subscriber post to uh, be part to take part in the giveaway. And also obviously follow me on Instagram and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And yeah. I'm not going to keep you guys here for any longer. Thank you for watching and I'll catch all of you guys in my next crypto update, which should hopefully be later on today. Until then, take care and peace.